Good evening, everybody, and welcome to this evening's update on Winter Storm Indigo. So Winter Storm Indigo is going to bring a wide swath of snow from the northern plains through the Great Lakes into the mid-Atlantic and even northeast. And opening up with the National Weather Service's Watches, Warnings, and Advisories map, uh, we have winter weather advisories across portions of Washington State, Idaho, and Oregon in the purples with winter storm warnings in the Cascades. And then we have winter weather advisories from northeastern Montana through southwestern South Dakota, all of, most of South Dakota, central northeast Nebraska, most of Iowa, northern Illinois, most of Indiana, all of Ohio, southern Michigan, most of Pennsylvania, all of Kentucky, most of Tennessee, western North Carolina, northern western Virginia, Maryland, Delaware, and northern southern New Jersey, with winter storm warnings across northeastern Nebraska, the Rockies of Colorado, winter weather advisories across southeastern Wyoming, and then uh, winter storm warnings uh, off of Lake Michigan to the south in southwest Michigan, northern Indiana. Then we have more winter storm warnings around the Cleveland area into northwestern Pennsylvania, as well as southeastern Ohio, most of West Virginia, far southeastern Kentucky, western Vir Virginia, far southern Pennsylvania. And then we have winter storm warnings in the Philadelphia area, southern New Jersey, and northern Delaware as well. We have hard freeze warnings across central Miss Mississippi, Alabama, northeastern Louisiana, freeze warnings across southeast Texas, southern Louisiana, southern Mississippi, southern Alabama, southwest Georgia, and southeastern Georgia, and freeze watches across deep south Texas, deep south Louisiana, and northeastern Florida around the Jacksonville area. So winter weather continues across most of the lo lower 48, and some lake effect snow warnings to the east of Erie and Ontario in Buffalo and Watertown. So taking a look at the current radar, as of 3.35 p.m. Central Standard Time this evening, we have a new storm impacting the Pacific Northwest, bringing rain west of the Cascades and snow east of the Cascades. And then we have our winter storm Indigo, bringing snow to portions of eastern Nebraska, northeast Kansas, most of Iowa. We got snow in Lincoln and Omaha, Nebraska this evening, as well as Des Moines, Iowa. And this is going to continue to move to the southeast, the east-southeast through the evening and into the overnight tonight. And then we got lake effect snow ongoing across Buffalo and Watertown, heavy lake effect snow. Many areas have seen two to three feet of snow already to the east of Lakes Erie, Lakes Erie and Ontario. And then we got some snow showers across Pennsylvania, uh, some snow showers across West Virginia, Central Kentucky, Eastern Tennessee, Western North Carolina, and some freezing rain mixing in in Northeastern Tennessee as well. So timing out winter, winter storm indigo in the 18Z run of the HRRR model. As of four o'clock this afternoon, we have the snow across portions of Nebraska, South Dakota, Southern Minnesota, Iowa. And as we go through the evening, going into about seven o'clock central time, heavy snow can move into Kansas City, uh, continuing across Iowa, Southwest Wisconsin into Illinois, and freezing rain could pick up across central Kentucky and ten Tennessee. As we go into the uh, middle of the night around 12 a.m., snow overspreads Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, southwest Michigan, southeastern Wisconsin, Chicago, St. Louis getting some snow. And then as we go into tomorrow morning, uh, these two systems are going to combine across the Ohio Valley. Going into about 2 a.m. Central Time, snow continuing across the Midwest. And then as we're waking up into about 7 a.m. tomorrow morning, Snow will exit Chicago, continue, continuing across all of Indiana, Kentucky, Ohio, Southeast Michigan, in areas like Detroit, Indianapolis, Columbus, Cincinnati, Lexington, Kentucky. And then as we go through the morning, the snow will gradually move to the east, into the northeast, and taking a look at the mid-Atlantic and northeast, snow will move across Virginia, West Virginia, and Pennsylvania through the early morning tomorrow as you're waking up, waking up to uh, widespread moderate snow across Pennsylvania, New Jersey, uh, Maryland, Northern Virginia, Washington, D.C., Philadelphia, and New York City. And then as we go through the day, the snow is going to get heavy across the Philadelphia 
uh, southern central New Jersey, potentially New York City area, could be seeing very heavy snow all uh, through the afternoon. This is about 5 o'clock Eastern time now. Heavy snow across Delaware, New Jersey, New York City, Philadelphia, New York into southeastern New England, and then snow will slowly taper off as we go into Friday night, Saturday morning. So taking a look at our snowfall accumulations in the 18Z run of the HRRR model, looking at a good widespread 2 to 4 inches of snow across far southeast South Dakota, northeastern Nebraska, Iowa, into Illinois, including Des Moines, uh, Omaha, Nebraska, Sioux Falls, Sioux City. And then we could see a good 2 inches of snow in Chicago going into Indiana and Ohio. Could be seeing a good 3 to 5 inches of snow across most of these states, extending into eastern Kentucky. And then we could see a, a, a very heavy lake effect band of snow set up across northern Indiana and far southwestern Michigan, where this could bring as much as a foot to two feet of snow wherever this lake effect band sets up. And then looking further to the east, as uh, across West Virginia in the Appalachian Mountains, we're looking at a good 6 to 12 inches of snow into far western Maryland. M uh, most of Pennsylvania seeing 3 to 6 inches of snow, including areas like Pittsburgh, Altoona, into um, Scranton and Philadelphia and Allentown, southern New Jersey, seeing about 3 to 5 inches of snow. And then snow extends all the way down into uh, western North Carolina in the mountains as well of about up to six inches of snow and then about one to two inches across southeast new england and new york city and closing off with ice accumulations in the h triple r model mostly very light with about a glaze to a tenth of an inch across portions of kentucky tennessee western virginia and western north carolina so thanks for watching this evening's update on winter storm indigo uh, make sure you're preparing for a uh, nice snowstorm across the uh, across the north central plains through the southern great lakes ohio valley and especially the northeast uh, please stay safe and have a wonderful evening my friends